like extremely poked out. I'm pretty sure he wants to jump on me. Yeah, there he comes. There he comes. He's jumping. I feel it. Just uh, hold it. <laughs> At least it wasn't Get me. Fucked. Could have been you. What is up, beautiful people? Welcome back to my channel. It's Celadin here. Today we're playing ranked duel as Honor versus Kali. Starting as per usual on the speed buff. Gonna word up a little bit further right here against the sneaky place with the blink. How you guys doing? Having a wonderful day? I'm having a good one so far. As per usual, hit the gym. <laughs> Get back from work. <laughs> Overall, doing decent. Having a nice day, not very tired, so have a good feeling about this one. Uh, I believe my clear here on the honor is not spectacular enough, so we are going straight for the wave. Picking up the speed buff uh, because we're in ADC and attack speed benefits us quite greatly. You want to pop this pop because we took a little bit of poke and we're going to be boxing right now. I'm pretty sure it's as a Cali, he should be aggressive right here. Maybe not. He actually looks like he one of those players who's gonna wait for the ultimate. That means that we can be a bully. I wish I didn't suck so much. Uh, then we might have been a bully. His clear is still intact, but I had to push him away to not get poked out. gonna lose a little bit more gold when these pe with this minions going into the base he sticks around for the experience which is expected this allows me to take this blue without any problem I'm pretty sure he should have gone for his blue we now have an ult and I don't believe he does so we should look nope he's hit five just now okay Where the hell is he? Should I try and freeze the lane a little bit? No, I don't think so. Also, I'm experimenting with my mic placement, so if there's any sound quality <laughs> or lower sound quality, I apologize for that in advance. But yeah, recently I found out that there's a lot of noise uh, every now and then coming through the mic from my keyboard which is a uh, logitech pro by the way but yeah it gets loud when during intense plays so hmm, i'm looking for a better position for my mic oh i'm gonna burn my ultimate here that word actually didn't pop the fact that he was taking red oh that's very bad he's gonna follow me up ha ah, pussy what's up little pussy he lags that big dick energy. He's trying to bait the jump. Little he knows. <laughs> Joke's on him. I don't have a jump right now. Okay. We avoided the stun. Gonna slow him down here a little bit. Maybe get some poke. Just one auto. Whatever. We're oom. Um, I don't believe he pays attention to that. But we're definitely gonna back here has Blackthorn Hammer for some reason. I don't think it's a good pickup for Kali. Obviously, he's a little bit tanker and he not going to have any mana problems. And this map is a lot about sustain. So it might not be a bad pickup. It, I just feel like it's not a very good pickup for Kali. I don't think he can catch up with me. That was an even trade. Oh. Obviously not enough damage, but close enough. He's baiting. He wants to jump on me. Let's see. We haven't got a kill in all this time. We, we need to do something about it. If I do this perfectly, it's going to work and look really good. If I don't, it's going to be a free kill for him. I feel, I feel, I feel it in my jellies. 
Ah, didn't, didn't do that, huh? So I'm, like, extremely poked out. I'm pretty sure he wants to jump on me. Yeah, there he comes. There he comes. He's jumping. I feel it. Just... Ah. Uh, hold it. it. Get fucked. That was exactly what I had in mind. And it's so satisfying it went that way. It might have went completely ugly if I choked or missed. It would have been just a free kill here I am. I, I had like two hits of HP on me. I really don't believe I can do that. That's unfortunate. We'll have to come back to this later. Go for Ninja Tabi here with Transcendence is an obvious choice. Um, in my opinion, it's the only choice right now. The power boots, they completely ruined them. Uh, Ninja Tabi just have so much more stats. So much more stats. It's just insane. It's not even a comparison. I don't know how they not pay attention to that. Alright. The ult on the red buff this time works. He wants to walk up to me and stun. This is pretty good. He holds up to his jump way too much in my opinion. This looks bad, but I think I can play around it. Just need to bait the bracer here. There you go. Yeah, he has really no choice. Uh, it's Kali, you go all in. In these kind of situations, uh, you have to go all in. And that's exactly what he did. And I just, all I had to do is just stay calm, play around it. Let's see if this is up. Oh, it just came up, huh? That's extremely dangerous here. But what's good about it is that he has to choose between the wave and the buff. And if he comes for this blue, then he loses a lot of wave. He might be coming this way. We should go safe route and just back right over here. Since it's Kali, I will not go on the Mian line or Breastplate. Usually the good pickup against Kali, Bakasur and that kind of stuff is uh, Midguardian. Midguardian is a very strong pickup against gods that can only apply auto attack damage. Especially with assassins because you slow their move speed. And yeah, they have a hard time. He looks like baiting me. No, he just straight up backed. Okay, let's look at these. Those are up. Overall, pretty good advantage. We have uh, 1500 gold ahead of him. Some experience. He should feel the pressure right now. But the fact is, it's still Kali. I can lose any fight. Even with all the pressure and advantage. Oh, way. I was expecting him to jump way further than that. Kind of jump on me. I might have poked him and stunned him. That might have went well, but he just wanted to clear. We got the red buff control again, which is nice. Just keep him engaged with that pillar. The slow is really annoying. It's just so much pressure. More like mental pressure. You just keep getting slow. You know that my hits are gonna hurt if I hit you while you're standing in it, so that's pretty well. Yeah, let's BM each other with this back a little bit. God, I suck. Either I suck so much or he's just so good at juking. <laughs> I feel like it's the first one, but you never know. That's not an even trade for him. I don't have life steal just yet, but that's not an even trade for him. He hauled off on his stun for some reason. Let's put some damage, he can't come in. There's a solid chance that the blue's up. Word this up right here. Yeah, he lost another blue. The mids are also up. I wonder if you stand on the edge. Do you take the experience from the wave? I don't think you do. This is a bad spot. This might be too greedy. Oh, there he comes. He didn't stun. I'm probably dead here. Yeah, the bracer didn't give me enough. I knew it. 
He did hold off on his stun. That was a really good play by him. The red's coming up, but I don't want to risk it without having notes. So we're just gonna do our blue quite safely. Now we can contest my ult is coming up in two seconds. He's nowhere to be found. Is he doing the Demon King? No, he did his spin. All right. But I should keep in mind the Demon King. Maybe ward it up as well. He did not attempt the Demon King, huh? That's really weird of him. I need to really be more disciplined about holding off to my stun and jump. There's no reason to jump away from him. Unless he jumps first. Oh, the minion! God damn it! Yeah, that's what I was saying about him. Alright, he beats for my stun. That allows me to just push him away. Got half of my HP. He should go for the Demon King here. But now I have Life Steal, which changes things drastically. He should not be very comfortable with doing that, so he should be at least half HP right now. <laughs> he dealt enough damage, so we're just gonna grab it instead. Hold enough to our jump here. Now we jump, just keep him at the distance, it's fine. I don't need to kill him right now. He will most probably back. Let's ward up, if he comes up, I'm gonna kill him. I just want this tower and postpone the ability for him to go on my Phoenix. So that was a pretty good play. Good engagement, but without an ult, I really don't want to approach him. I zoned him there pretty uh, pretty well. That's all I wanted. I need to give this uh, speed buff online. This is what allows me to keep the distance between me and him. So far, it's been really working out. He has Nemean, so we're obviously going into some penetration. The Executioner will be the pen of choice for me, since Honor has a little bit of flat pen in his kit. I usually tend to do that on Honor. Exe works really well with his passive. Grab those as well. We might back for tier 2, but it's not a big spike anyways. With Asi now, all the poke he does with this too is negligible for me. Just dropping this so he won't have it. Oh, that was a good stun, but he's about to jump me? No? I can hold on to it. He jumped in place. That's his thorns. Let's just walk out of it. Unfortunately, I bracered. I maybe should have hauled on to it. So we traded thorns for bracer. Which is an even trade, so... Hmm. Maybe it wasn't as good as I felt it was. But he felt the pressure and we get his blue again, so at least we got that going for us. I'm gonna grab a ward for an incoming D Demon King fight. I just need key to be aware when he goes for it. And just in general, I like to have a ward in my inventory so the enemy would be under impression that I'm aware of what he's doing at all times. Beware this is more of a mental time. game. I really feel like a lot of top dual players that can just annihilate me entirely would really benefit from more mind games like that. Just having a word in general in your inventory just shows to your opponent that, oh, you might be sneaky, but you never know. Like right over here, I don't have a word directly on Demon King, but if she goes for it from any direction, I will be aware. And yeah, I will be there on time. Like, right there she goes. Maybe he also just did word it and that's all he did. He gone for his speed. The distance between the Demon King and his speed is just too big. And I believe I have enough damage to benefit from that. 
Yeah, I'm just shredding it. He's not gonna be here on time. Yeah, this map is a lot bigger than it should be for duel. Oh, there he comes. He holds off to his stun again. I'm in a bad spot. I'm gonna head in minions though. That should work. Oh, he's panicking. Just hold off the bracer. I did not time this right, but... Oh, right! Yep. I did not time the uh, stun right, but it still worked out in the end. Yeah, this build, I don't think that Blackthorn Hammer was doing any good for him. But yeah, a ranked duel, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the game. I upload every other day. If you did enjoy the game, please leave a like and a comment. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe. And as always, have a wonderful day. I will see you in the next video.